Welcome to Inside Science TV. You don't notice it and you can't see it, but every day there's a river of air about five to seven miles above us that zooms by overhead. This current of air, called the jet stream, travels around 110 miles per hour across the globe. And why should you care about it? It essentially moves weather systems around the world. Jet streams form where air masses of different temperatures meet in the atmosphere. The greater the difference in temperature, the faster the jet stream moves. Faster winds push weather systems around, bringing storms to some areas and fair weather to others. The jet stream has what are called long waves or long dips in the jet stream. Within that big long wave, as we sometimes refer to it, are smaller disturbances, little ripples that we call short waves. Uh, and those are the ones that produce our day-to-day -day weather. In the winter, the polar jet stream dips south across the lower third of the U.S., bringing in colder air and sometimes strong storms. One of the biggest industries affected and interested in the jet stream is aviation. It affects the speed and safety of air travel every day. The higher up we go, the more likely we will encounter the maximum winds. If flying from west to east across the U.S., it can speed up your flight. If going from east to west, it'll slow it down. Studying the jet stream to improve weather forecasting on the ground and in the air. I'm Josh Lebowitz reporting. Inside Science TV. If you enjoyed this edition, follow us on Facebook, Twitter, and YouTube. Powered by the American Institute of Physics and a coalition of underwriters.